13 years ago, we embarked on this collaboration. We envision these films as a trilogy, so Anthropocene is the third in a trilogy that includes manufactured landscapes and watermark. Anthropocene as a concept is drawing attention to the fact that humans as a species now dominate the planet in every way which means that we change the Earth systems more than all natural processes combined. And that's a huge thing to kind of take in. As you see, we have sun every day, so we have a really good evaporation rate here. And that's what makes most of the work. The energy comes from the sun. Eighty-five percent of the Earth's forests have been cleared, fragmented, or degraded for human use. There is the museum exhibition, and the museum exhibition is made up of photography, film installations, murals, film extensions of those murals, and then augmented reality, or kind of virtual sculptures, that are all, in a way, intended to use lens-based media to deepen experiential understanding. The film will extend in a different way, in a narrative way, all of these elements that you will also experience in the exhibition. In order to really understand the extent of our impact, you have to express the scale of it. And so scale is very important conceptually, but conveying scale is very difficult, and it's not always clear where to stand. This is one view of this place. But what that one wide view doesn't get is all of the potential narrative details that are happening in that place. The ethics of what we do as documentarians is probably the most important element of our work because we do go all around the world into these different contexts. And if you don't go into those places with humility and the right attitude and a kind of openness, you're not going to be able to convey that place. Our connection with people, the people who are in these contexts, or in this film, the other species as well that are in these contexts, is a crucial element to creating that reaction in a viewer that is empathetic. This was an interdisciplinary kind of endeavor. I mean, it's very much an art project and an art film, but it was informed by science much more profoundly, I would say, than the other two were. And I found that really uh, gratifying and engaging and kind of fascinating to have to go so deep into that world to understand what we were seeing and then to try to figure out how to convey that.